we are going to study today assets, equity, and liabilities in accounting equation. Uh, you know, you can identify assets and liabilities using terms. Terms. We know there's three terms past, present, and future. Both assets and liabilities arise because of past transaction. In present, assets are controlled by the organization, controlled by the organization. In present, liabilities are responsible for outsiders. In future, assets generate cash, so cash into the organization. In future liabilities, cash out to the out from the organization. Assets are two types, non-current assets and current assets. In the same way, liabilities also to divide two categories, non-current liabilities and current liabilities. In non-current assets, we have a lot of assets, land, buildings, motor vehicles, machinery, uh, computers, air conditions, and long-term investment. As you can see, every asset are uh, more than one year old. In current assets, you could identify inventory, trade, debtors, other receivables, all payments, cash and cash equivalents. In non-current liabilities, you can identify bank loans, debentures, lease, and current liabilities, trade payables, other payables, such as and bank or dropped in other papers you can identify accruals as well so the equity equity divided into two one part is capital and the other part is retain earnings we know retain earnings are uh, coming from the profit so profit we would divide into two income and expenses income uh, increase the profit and increase the equity expenses are uh, drive the profit and drive the equity so the capital you can identify two types extra capital and drawings extra capital increase the capital and increase the equity drawings decrease the capital and decrease the equity so that is the assets equity and liability now you know how to identify assets equity and liabilities in accounting equation